In the last year, Chicago's theater scene has bounced back from the height of the pandemic, but how high? Two's got your ticket. CBS2 entertainment reporter Vince Gerasoli sat down with the folks at Broadway in Chicago who bring some of the biggest productions to town to find out. A lot of us went back to Chicago theaters in 2022, but did everyone come out for the show? Tonight, let me tell you a story. Welcome to the show. Broadway in Chicago brings some of the biggest budget productions to town. The organization says as theaters reopened, a pent-up supply of splashy shows lit up marquees. When I was a boy, there was star power, world premieres, and the return of well-known favorites. Hey, sister, no, sister. Lou Raisin, president of Broadway in Chicago, says audience response helped the organization bring jobs back to nearly 1,000 people. Sure. Here's a question that's on my mind right now. How did 2022 stack up for Chicago theater and Broadway in Chicago in particular? We think back a hundred years ago uh, at the, the at the prior uh, nightmare of uh, a pandemic, and it was culture that led the way back. And to a large degree, that's what we've seen here. The demand has been really incredible. When you say that the ticket sales are going well, can you give me some uh, quantification of that? Though, are we at pre-pandemic levels? Are we still catching up? Are we going beyond? You know, our, we're not a widget company, so it's not like we can tell you how many widgets on the shelf and compare it quarter to quarter. We ebb and flow based on the theatrical talent that's available to us. Popular. I know about popular. At the onset, we were spending what turned out to be about 120% on marketing to see 80% of the show, 80% uh, of the audience coming back. Those numbers have changed over time. We are pretty much heading back to being on par. Um, you know, we're not quite there, but we're getting there. We've had Wicked and Lion King as two exceptional shows that have gone to the walls on sales. Um, it's, it's really been absolutely thrilling. Raisin says that 2023 will usher in a healthy number of productions here to the city of Chicago. But when it comes to titles on the marquee, we'll notice that the pandemic did slow down the creation of newer material. Still, I'm just happy the show goes on. Remember, two's got your ticket. I'm Vince Girasoli, CBS2 News.